What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bino. I'm back at it again. And that's right, I got another banger for you guys from another plug as well that I just hooked up recently. So shout out to them for sending me this pair. And yeah, as you can see, it's in this package, this beautiful, wonderful package that's been beat up, torn, dirty, but still got here. You know what I'm saying? So while we get right to it and just open it from there, all right? Hey, ooh, oh shit. You see, now this is the hard part right here. There we go, much better. So, I know this pair is supposed to come out a week from now and we already have our early release from it, but yeah. Yeah, it's about that time. Man, let's take a look. Oh, oh Lord, man. Lord, Lord, Lord. And of course, a little thank you from them. A little thank you from them as well. Put it right there to the side. Oh, it fell. All right. So, I'm just happy that they sent me an early pair of the Lightning Fours because Thunder's black and yellow, and this is um, yellow and gray. So, my bad. Lightning Fours. Now, this pair originally released back in 06, where this shoe was just simply iconic. And back then, they had the messed up Jumpman logo where one leg was skinny. One leg was crooked, the leg, w the arm was skinny itself. So, you'll see that. You'll see in the image up top right there. But since they remastered this pair, we got a better Jumpman version than this one. Almost reminds me of my Black Cat 4s, my Bread 4s from 2019, and my University 4s as well. Also my Topai Haze 4s, I forgot about those. See, it's been a while. But this pair is just absolutely amazing. I love it, the details look amazing. One thing I would say they got off though was the side piece right here. Um, as you can see right here one of the pockets i call these pockets right here close to the squares close to the cage right here the pocket right there but eh, it doesn't matter every four is different not every four is the same or practically the same and on this side it's this part is okay as well but it doesn't matter it's a shoe we wear our shoes until they we can't wear them no more so this pair is actually absolutely dope and it's wonderful and i love it also comes with a set of laces, as you can see, set of laces right here, white laces. Um, I, if you was gonna cop this shoe, I prefer to do mix and match yellow and white laces if y'all want, but it's up to y'all. As you can see right here, got that gray Jumpman logo in the insole, got that bottom sole as well too. It kind of reminds me of a cool gray four sole. Yeah, this part right here. This, I don't know why, but it kind of reminds me of the cool gray sole. Cool gray four soul, if you think about it. It's kind of interesting, I don't know. Unless maybe they did some creativity or whatever, but it's close. It's closely similar to the cool gray four, maybe. I bought the other pair right here. Boom. As you can see, they kind of <laughs> did their thing and messed up the pockets, but it's okay though. To rate this shoe, I haven't seen nobody wear this yet, but I have seen people review the old one. I'll give this a 9.5 out of 10. Not because of its remastering, but because of how many times people have talked about the rumors of returning or how many times people have talked about in general how the Lightning 4 is, you know, a controversial pair, but not yet though. So we'll see what happens when people start reviewing this pair. But we got an early release. Shout out to the plug for sending me this. And the suede of this shoe is beautiful. The fabrication inside the sole is beautiful as well. The bottom sole is perfect. The Jumpman logo is on point as well. I'm not mad about that. I would be mad if it was crooked. The back of the shoe as well too is perfect as well. And even the toe box as well is perfect. So shout out to them for sending me this. And of course, I forgot the little pinky trick. The pinky trick right here. Amazing, absolutely amazing. So I thank the plug for sending me this shoe. It's absolutely wonderful. I love it. And I can't wait to rock them on my feet for this year, for sure. 
So since we talked about the shoe, let's get to this on foot review and go from there. 